So uh, to start, hit the design button, either at the bottom or hit F4. Okay. Uh, this is going to bring up uh, the menu, right? So hit new design. At the beginning of the game, there shouldn't be anything besides the truck there. Okay. So hit new design. That's the green one. Okay. So I'm playing uh, a game that's been going on for a while. So I have lots of stuff already unlocked because I've researched it. Uh, so let's kind of go over the different body types. So there's a light category, there's a medium category, and a heavy category. Uh, the light ones, uh, let me show you the Viper. So the Viper is the one that the game starts with, okay? Uh, you can see how much energy it costs. It costs 30. You can see its hit points, 240. Uh, the next thing that you have to do is you have to ha uh, add propulsion, okay? So how are you going to get around? Are you going to be on wheels? Are you going to be on half tracks, tracks, a hover body, or an airplane? So VTOL, vertical takeoff and landing. Okay, so those are the what five propulsion types in the game. Uh, the ones that I would suggest using are half track and track for tanks. Uh, if you're going to make VTOLs, you don't have any choice there. It's only one type. Okay. Um, wheels, you really only want to use early game. Uh, so here's the trade-offs. Okay. Wheels, they're the fastest on the ground, and they have the least hit points. Half tracks have more hit points, but they're a little bit slower. Still pretty fast. Tracks, they have the most hit points, uh, but they're the slowest. Hovers, uh, I'm not sure where exactly they fall. They're very fast, and they're weak. Uh, generally, we use half tracks when we're playing online. Half tracks and tracks. Okay, so stick with those. Um, all right, so that's propulsion, uh, and then we can talk about weapons. Okay, so this is probably the most confusing part, and I still don't understand it fully. But basically, let's go to some basic units. Um, so basically, let's start with some bodies. Okay, so we'll do the Cobra, and we'll do half track. Okay. Cobra, half track, and I have a mini pot weapon. So uh, when we look at the weapons, we see a couple of different things. Okay, we see the range, so it's 8.5 tiles. It does 79 damage and 109 rate of fire. So if we look at other weapons, let's compare it. Okay, so the mini pot is a relatively early game weapon. Uh, it gets outclassed. Um, so the Scourge, for example, it does 630 damage, it shoots 14 tiles, which is much further, much more damage, and the rate of fire is much slower, okay, so 21. It's also heavier than the mini pod, so it weighs 400 versus the mini pod's 200, okay? So those are ways you can compare stuff. Generally, it's high damage, low rate of fire versus high rate of fire, low damage, or medium, you know, rate of fire, medium damage. So uh, things that are good against tanks are like high damage, low rate of fire, you know, shoot, bam, it's dead. Things that are better against cyborgs are high rate of fire, lower damage, okay, so they can mow them down more or less. Um, and then things in between are stuff like cannons, where they have a moderate rate of fire and moderate damage, okay. So cannons are kind of good at everything. Well, they're pretty good at everything, I should say. So that's our unit. Once we make it, uh, it's saved in our menu, okay? Um, there's all different types of weapons, okay? So mini pods you get pretty early in the um, in the game. There's all kinds of crazy stuff. So there's uh, there's rail guns, there's tank killer rockets, there's weapons that shoot airplanes. So you know AA um, anti aircraft. There's uh, big crazy uh, you know plasma cannons. There's lasers, there's uh, artillery in the game. Uh, it looks like I'm playing on a map that doesn't have artillery uh, allowed. But there's artillery that shoots really, really far. Um, there's lots of different kinds of stuff, so lots of cool stuff there. There's other things that you can put on top of your units that aren't weapons, okay? So the most important ones that you should learn are the truck top, okay? So when you start the game, you have trucks, and if you want to design different trucks, you just, you know, do it like this. Um, there's also sensors that you can use. 
there's the wide set spectrum sensor that you get that later in the game. There's repair units you can make. There's other ones that you won't use very often, so VTOL strike turret, uh, CB radar turret, uh, CB, you'll, you want to use that every once in a while. Um, they come up when you're using artillery, okay? Counter batteries for artillery, picking up enemy artillery. Um, so those are the basic non-weapon uh, turret types, okay? So in games, you'll want to make a couple different types of units pretty often. So one that I would suggest is this unit, so Cobra Mini Rocket Pod Half Track. So make it and then hit save, bam. Um, and then if you want to delete it, you can hit it again and it'll delete it, okay? Another one that I would suggest is Cobra Half Track uh, Heavy Machine Gun. I don't think I have it anymore. Yeah, uh, but yeah, heavy machine gun. So same thing as the last one, but with a heavy machine gun. Um, another one that I would suggest is a light cannon. So these are early game ones that you're going to want to have. Another one of my favorites is the uh, track mantis body. Um, and for the weapons, you'll want to use Lancer. Uh, Lancer upgrades to Scourge, so I don't have it, but Lancer and uh, assault gun. Uh, I don't have assault gun either. I've, it's been upgraded to twin assault gun. Okay, but you know you can make those and then store them. Um, let's see what else? Oh, uh, so like at this stage in the game, the units that I like to make are the scourge missile tiger tracks and the twin assault gun tiger tracks. So when you save them, right, and you play a different game, you play a multiplayer game or something like that. Uh, as you unlock the technology, uh, the stored templates that you have will pop up. So once you can make it, it'll show in your menu. And then when you go to your factory, you'll go, oh, now I can make, you know, this type of tank. And then you can change your uh, factory production. Okay. So those are some of my favorite units that, uh, you know, you'll be using pretty commonly. So I would suggest uh, storing them so you can use them uh, yourself.